Hello friends, welcome back to my channel. Today I have talk on the basic mutations of Java Sparrow. There are a number of mutations readily available, first one is normal, also known as wild type, gray or even native color. Characteristics, the photo illustrates how the normal is found in the wild. Its slick gray feathering is seamless, and there are no white feathers present anywhere on the bird's body except in the cheeks and the under the tail feathers. Second one is silver, also known as opal. Genetics, recessive. Characteristics, all of the bird's pheomelanin is missing giving the bird a pale gray appearance. Availability, another very common and popular mutation, with a large following of fanciers. Available worldwide. Third one is fawn, also known as Isabella brown. Genetics, recessive. Characteristics, all of the bird's eumomelanin is missing giving the bird a brown fawn appearance. Two variations are recognized and referred to as red-brown and beige-brown, the latter being darker in color and less ginger. Availability of very common and popular mutation, with a large following of fanciers. Available worldwide. Fourth one is white also known as black-eyed whites or pure whites. Genetics, recessive. Characteristics, all traces or plumage color is removed showing no trace of pheo or eumomelanin, just pure white feathers. Beak, leg, and eye ring color is unaffected. Availability, a fairly common mutation. Fifth one is pied. Genetics, recessive, though splits may sometimes be discernible from white tick marks, mostly appearing on the throat and wing edges. Characteristics, patches of white appear all over the bird's plumage in haphazard patterns, ideally covering around 50% of the overall plumage. Availability pied are common, although many may be of reduced coverage, ideal 50% evenly marked birds being sought after. Sixth one is pastel, also known as dilute. Genetics, sex-linked. Characteristics, the overall body color is muted, whilst retaining all of the bird's pheomelanin a certain amount of eumomelanin is lost in varying amounts giving its appearance a dilution of color. Availability, although not yet common. Seventh one is agate also known as topaz in Europe and cherry blossom in Japan. Genetics, recessive. Characteristics, the head color of the agate is dark brown and seemingly void of eumomelanin though other areas remain gray, unlike the pastel. Nestlings appearing ginger in color. Availability, this mutation is rare in aviculture. Eight one is cheekless, also known as black-headed. Genetics, this mutation can be recessive, but as yet this has not been established due to the appearance of many freak occurrences within aviculture which prove to have uninheritable traits. Characteristics, the body color is slightly darker than the normal type, and the white cheeks are missing. Usually after second adult molt the white cheeks appear. Availability, very rare. Ninth on is another agate, but different from the topaz agate which we discussed above. It's same name for different mutations in different countries. Genetic sex link mutation. Characteristics, the eumelanin is partly suppressed. Therefore the pheomelanin comes into its own, then consequently the bird appears brown in color. And the plumage beige, availability, although not yet common. See the difference between fawn and agate. So these were all basic mutations of Java Sparrow. Thanks for watching. Be updated by pressing the bell icon and by subscribing the channel. Have a good day.